guys, what's up? Um, I'm here again for another review, and uh, this time it's on Bachman, Bill and Ben. Or Bill and Ben, sorry. Yeah, Bill and Ben. Let me go into the Railway Series history, TV series, and you guys pretty much know the drill. Okay, so I'm going to start off with Railway Series. Bill and Ben first appeared in the Railway Series book, Mainline Engines. They appeared in the story, um... The Diseasel, I believe, which was their which was their first appearance, I believe, and then they appeared in frequently throughout books, I think. So, they made their first appearance in this in season two. Of, uh, they made their first appearance in season two, and yeah, they actually actually they made their first appearance in Percy takes the plunge. But that wasn't their official introduction. They made their real official introduction in the Diseaso. Again, it's based on the Railway series. And then they were like you know main characters from seasons two, three. I don't think they were main characters in season four, but in season five there were main characters. Season six, yes. Season seven. <coughs> <coughs> And then sadly, they, I don't think they appeared in season eight, but I do believe that they do that it, they did appear in season, I think nine or ten, I believe, either one. Then they had cameos, in, and then they had some cameos in season eleven. Now season twelve is where Ben appeared by himself. Now season twelve is where Ben appeared by himself. Now I actually like that, you know, that should happen a lot more. Ben should appear by himself, like Ben only, and stuff. Actually, yeah, let me go into Ben real quick. Ben actually appeared twice, twice by himself. He appeared once in the, by himself in the season 9 episode, Bold and Brave, and then again in season 12, with Gordon takes a shortcut. And then after that, they... A and then after season 12, well, Ben mainly, Bill and Ben were not seen for, until season 17, which was a real shame. And then finally season 17, they finally made their, their they finally made their, fur, their real return. Their official, their official return. Thanks to Andrew Brenner, because Bill and Ben are Andrew Brenner's favorite characters. So, yeah, um, that's about the history about it. Now let's go into the basis of the twins. Bill and Ben are based off the Ju Alfred and Judy prototypes, I think, which is by the Bagnall. I don't know, actually. I, I have to remember, like, what class Bill and Ben are based on. And, um, yeah. So, on to the models themselves. Um... I'm gonna move Bill out of the way. I'm actually gonna do Ben. I'm actually gonna take a look at Ben because, well, Ben's my favorite out of the twin out of the two. I'm sorry if any of you like both twins. I'm just I'm sorry. It's just I like Ben more than Bill. Okay. <coughs> so um yeah, if I had to pick a favorite, it would be Ben. And um. Looking at both of the models, I like them, you know? I mean, they're, t they're TV series accurate, model series-wise. And, uh... I don't know what else to say. Um... Oh, yeah, the whistles. Um... Let me just zoom in on Bill's whistle on the cab... Now, Bill's whistle is good. It has, like, the little end stick piece at the, at the end of his whistle. However, you take a look at Ben's whistle. His whistle kind of looks like Percy's, if I'm not mistaken. Hang on. I have Percy right here. Actually, this is a better way of how to view both whistles. 
tell me, do, does Ben's whistle look a lot like Percy's? Tell me. Tell me, does Ben's whistle look a lot like Percy's whistle? Let me know in the comments. Faces are really good. Bet Bill's got his wide-eyed grin. Ben's got that, you know, half half squinted eyes grin, I guess. I don't know. But this Ben's face is actually from The Great Discovery. I actually pulled up an image from The Great Discovery special, which aired in 2008. And his face is actually a perfect match. Their nameplates are good. I mean, the top is good. You know, all that. You know, friend coupler. Holy crap. Yay. I'm just kidding. I'm kidding. I am glad. I'm kidding about that part. But I am glad that they put front couplers on Bill and Ben. And on Donald and Douglas. I'm glad about that because when Thomas, Percy, and James first came out, they didn't have front couplers. <coughs> but, you know, whatever. Um... Honestly, I can't find anything wrong with Bill and Ben. Although, speed-wise, um, there's no power to this layout, sadly. It's like, you know. And, um, yeah, Bill and Ben, yeah. Um, man, I don't know what else to say about these twins. They, oh yeah, I forgot to mention their personality. Sorry about that, my bad. I'm a little rusty of doing reviews. I'm... A little rusty. Bill and Ben are the most cheeky and mischievous twins on the on Sodor. Which means that, you know, they like to play tricks on the other engines. And they actually played a trick on Gordon one time, too. And, um, Edward is the only one who can control them. Boko as well, I think. And I think Duck, maybe. I don't know. Maybe Duck also, because he calls Bill and Ben the bees. And, uh, yeah, that's all I can say about Bill and Ben, but speed, yeah, um, I think Bill, I'm sorry, the, Bill, I think Bill is faster than Ben, or maybe Ben is faster than Bill, I really don't know. I really don't know, um, I think I might have to do a speed test on these guys, but nonetheless... You know, um, yeah, oh yeah, let me talk about their, uh, hooks real quick. Their hooks are black, which is good. As you know, it's one of their later models. Bill and Ben were released in 2010, in, uh, sorry, in July of 2010. I was a sophomore in, uh, in high school when I got these. I was a sophomore in high school when I got this, when I got these two twins in 2010. But, yeah, I'm not going to talk about that. I'll talk about high school some other time. Or maybe I'll make it a video about high school. Whatever. I don't know. Um, if you haven't checked out anything, like, go check out my last two videos that I did about, you know, the Atherin Genesis 2 Locomotives review. Go check those out for Twiggy. Because Twiggy BNSF and I actually made those reviews. And, uh, yeah, go check those out. <laughs> Oh yeah, and also go check out my video about, it's called My High School Yearbooks. Um, anyway, yeah. So anyway, um. Yeah, that's all I can say about the twins. Um, that's all I can say, really. Um, there isn't really much talk about. Other than the fact that they look great. But, uh, yeah, um, I hope you guys enjoyed this review. I'm sorry if I t used minutes on this. Um, I'm really sorry. It's just, I don't know what else to say about the twins. I mean, you know, I, I don't know what else to say. One last quick look at Bill's face. And there's Ben's. 
Oh man, this video's at the 10 minute mark. I gotta, like, stop it or something. I don't know. But anyway, um, join me for the next review. Um, I give both of these guys 10 out of 10. So join me for the next review when I, uh... Actually, tell me in the comments on what models you want me to review next. I have Donald and Douglas, Stepney, and a German steam engine, and a few American locomotives. These bottom drop gondola cars by Walter's Mainline. These Tyco cars. Or these German cars. Tell me which one you guys want me to review in the comments. Tell me in the comments. Um, tell me in the comments. So, uh, yeah. Goodbye.